What's going on everyone? Hope you're having an amazing day as always. My name is Ryan Huff and this is The Qualified Life. Y'all, so um, hope y'all are staying safe out there. Today is March 21st and um, yeah, we are full blown in this whole quarantine thing. So let me tell you what I'm doing. We got a trash bag. It's full of trash. What the heck are we doing? Ryan, why are you on the side of the road picking up trash? Well, let me tell you. So give honor to whom honor is You know what I'm saying? So... <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, um, recently we were on Instagram and uh, a friend of mine, Christina, and her, I believe it's boyfriend, um, maybe it's fiance, maybe it's husband, I'm pretty sure it's boyfriend, um, but I will officiate your wedding, by the way, Christina, I am ordained, an ordained minister, I've done three weddings so far, would love to do it, it would be an honor, whenever uh, Sam pops the question, if he ends up doing it, let's go. Anyways, um... I saw her, she was out, dude, I forgot gloves. My hands are like disgusting right now and I shouldn't have touched my face just then. But alas, we're out here. Um, anyways, we've been washing our hands a lot, a lot. And I actually grabbed gloves before I went out here to do this, but then I left them sitting on the counter and I was already like half a mile away from home. I'm like, no. So anyways, but uh, I saw Christina the other day. She was out there with her Labradoodle donut and, how you doing? This table just gave me a look like, what the heck are you doing right now? It's fair. Um, <laughs> but anyway, she was out with Sam, her boyfriend, and uh, Donut, her Labradoodle, the other day. And I saw her posting on her Instagram. She was posting a picture with her Labradoodle that, <laughs> along with a bag of trash next to the Labradoodle. I'm like, what the heck? And so I read the context. And the context was that they were out picking up trash. They picked up a you know bag of trash every day during that week, and I was like, "Bro, I love that." And so I asked her, "I'm like, are y'all picking up trash on the side of the road?" And they go, "Yeah." And so I was like, "That is freaking cool." And so, anyways, so I was like, "You know what? Let's be a positive impact because that's exactly what being a positive impact is." And um, as you may or may not know, um, I run a positive impact brand, the positive impact brand called Qualified Apparel. We feed families in America through selling apparel. And so because of that, I'm like, dude, I love that. And so I'm like, how can I, you know, I want to, you know, avidly work on making a positive impact in my life with my company. And, uh, so yeah, went out here, grabbed a 33 gallon, uh, black trash bag, walked down the road <laughs> and, uh, proceeded to pick up trash. And you know what, dude, that's something that I encourage you with during this time, especially is to do things to be a positive impact. Now, that doesn't necessarily mean you need to go pick up trash on the side of the road, but maybe that does. Hey, why not? Why not do something like that? Or maybe you could start giving to, you know, an organization. Maybe you could, you know, buy some qualified apparel that feeds families in America. So you get some awesome apparel and feed, you know, everyone out and provides 20 meals for families in America. That's cool too. Or maybe it's just going out and providing food for someone that you know might be struggling right now or going out and washing someone's car, mowing their lawn for them, or just doing something to be a positive impact, you know, because as you know, with the qualified life, um, our goal with this, with this platform, with the qualified life is to empower you to chase your potential and live a life that makes a positive impact. And that doesn't necessarily do that positive impact. I mean, whatever it means to you, you know, just provided it's something that's helping, you know, move someone else's life forward and do good in their life, you know, because I love what Andy Frisella talks about. He's like, you know what? Success is the pursuit of your potential. And I could not agree with that more because the more you chase your potential, y'all, the more you do stuff in your life to make a difference, the more the world around you becomes better as well. So I just encourage you to do that, especially right now, um, because for a lot of us, <laughs> we, a lot of us, uh, we're out of work right now, you know? And so because of that, we have a lot more free time on our hands and there's a lot of opportunity that's going to be built out of this time because, you know, of innovation and like people, you know, thinking and everything else, but like, dude, there's no time like the present to be a positive impact. There's no time like the present to move your life forward. There's no time like the present to be a difference maker, you know? And so anyways, I just encourage you with that. Like do something today to be a positive impact and do something today to make a difference in someone's life. Now granted, this bag of trash is full now, a little bit heavy actually. <laughs> and 
Um, you know what? That's going to be cool because that's, that's, that's being a positive impact right now. And like for me and like with my company, with Qualified Apparel, I'm focusing on a campaign right now called The Need Just Got Bigger. And because, dude, the need just got bigger in this country to feed more families in America. So a lot more people are struggling right now, especially with all the craziness going on with the aftermath of the coronavirus and whatnot, right? No, will we come back stronger from this? Absolutely. But in the meantime, like I want to, I want to make a difference, right? I want to do something to be a positive impact, whether that's picking up trash on the side of the road or helping feed more families across America. So I just encourage you to do the same, you know, be a positive impact. That doesn't mean, that doesn't necessarily mean that you need to go feed families in America. That doesn't necessarily mean you need to go pick up trash on the side of the road, but whatever that could be for you, you know, maybe you go out and you have, you know, you get a group of less than 10 people around and y'all go around and y'all go out and I don't know, maybe, <laughs> I don't know. There's so many, there's so many things you could think of, um, but like maybe, maybe you do go out and pick up trash on the side of the road. Maybe you do go out and volunteer somewhere that where people need help. Maybe you do go out and raise awareness for a certain project. Maybe you do go out and maybe start writing that book you've always wanted to write. That's going to make a difference and share your story. I don't know. It's going to be different for everybody, but I just encourage you, I just encourage you right now to do something to be a difference maker, to do something to be a positive impact. You know, like I said, this whole channel is focused around to empower you to chase your potential and live a life that makes a positive impact, right? And by living a qualified life, you're doing just that. You're being a positive impact. You're going out and doing things to make this world a better place. So what are you going to do today? Leave it in the comments if you want. Y'all, thank you so much for listening today. I hope you're having an amazing day. Hope you're staying safe. Washing your hands plenty. I'm about to wash the heck out of mine because mine are gross right now. <laughs> oh, oh man, that's bad. But anyways, y'all, have a good one. Please, please, I encourage you to subscribe and then leave a like on this video if you enjoyed it and share it out with someone. But more importantly, be a positive impact in your life today. Until next time, chase your potential and live a life that makes a positive impact. See you guys.